Now in this video I'm going to show you how to connect the FreeSat Samsung S7800 to the internet so you can unlock BBC iPlayer and ITV Hub as well as streaming feature to the box from a NAS drive which is basically a network hard drive that connects to your, uh, your router and you can stream music, movies and photos. Bearing in mind though that this box only supports AVI format films. It doesn't support DivX or MP4, unfortunately. To connect your FreeSat box to the internet, you're going to need a Ethernet cable. And just simply plug it in to the back port. Plug the other end into your router or into a power line and you're ready to go. Now plug the other end into your router. And turn on the machine. Now the preset box is turned on. Now go to guide. On demand. the eye player and if you are successfully connected to your router and it's connected to the internet this screen will appear just press the red button on your on your free sat remote apparently this version will be turned off in September 2016 So that proves that works. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to uh, just press the change the channel. So just press the up presser, ITV hub. Wait a few moments. The screen will appear. Press red again. What's really good now is that we started putting Family Guy on. So if you missed it, you can now catch up on ITV Hub. You get a commercial uh, because it's paid by. Uh, advertisement now of course this is the G1 FreeSat platform this is across all G1 FreeSats now I'm just wait until it just loads the episode yes you get quite a bit of advertisement on it There we go. So that proves it works. Let's return. And I've uh, just, just press exit on the remote. Now this is the Samsung S7800.
I go to settings. That's how you can check your uh, connection is established. There you go. And that's, if that is empty, then of course, that's the reason why it's not working if it doesn't work. Okay, so now what's really clever about this box, the Samsung S7800, is if you click menu, go to media. Now, I've, if you've got a, um, that's to access the hard drive. Now, if you've got a NAS on your network, I've got a share, uh, it's called a D-Link Share Center. Uh, basically, it's a hard drive that's connected via the network of the Ethernet. So you can buy them for about anywhere between uh, £30 to about, uh, well, £500, depending on how much you want to pay. So I'll just click on network. It's a share center. And what it is, is you're, you can store videos, music, and you can stream it to the box. So this is the share center. Here's some of the movies I've got on there. Just gonna demo one of them. Show you it working. Psychoded irony. <laughs> it's actually a Samsung box. <laughs> it's displaying Sony. So you can just, uh, using the arrows on your remote, skip through the film to about here. It's a really clever box for, um, for what it is. It's five years old now, but you know, in my mind it's, it, it's uh, always going to find a use for it. So. And someone's just dropped the bomb. <laughs> uh oh. Here's a cool feature on this box. Anything you watch, it will display on the front panel of the screen on the Samsung S7800 preset box.